Wise Markets is launching its 14th annual Fight Hunger campaign, and it is going to help people in need right here in our own community. We've got Jamie Hanaski here to tell us more about how customers can get involved in that fight. How are you? I'm good, Elsa. Thanks for having me. Happy to have you here. We always love Wise. Tell us a little bit more about Wise Markets Fight Hunger campaign. So according to Feeding America, each year millions of Americans face hunger issues. And through the coronavirus pandemic, um, it has caused even more families to really struggle. So they estimate that 42 million people um, may be food insecure due to the pandemic. And that includes 13 million children. So just crazy numbers. And, you know, we're glad that we can help. The numbers were already high pre-pandemic and the pandemic just exacerbated that so much that this need is really, really significant. How can we as customers help those in our own community, our neighbors? So when you're shopping in your local wise markets, you can make a donation by simply rounding up your order to that next whole dollar. Um, As we know, um, a little bit goes a long way when it comes to fighting hunger. Um, You can make a one, three, five, or $10 donation. And something new that we started last year during the pandemic were our $8 grocery bags. You could pick a slip up in the store um, and then take that slip to the register. You pay $8 and we give a bag full of groceries um, to the food bank of items that they need. So we're not taking item donations from customers, but we are giving the food bank um, the necessary items and products that they need to make sure the food gets pushed out. Which is really, really helpful, even for us who are donating, because a lot of times we buy things and we think, is this what they need? Is this what they care? Or do they have enough? Or is this too much? Right. So it's nice that that's sort of a prepackaged option for us as the people who are donating. How will the Fight Hunger campaign impact our communities? What sort of um, positive effect will we see? In your region, in our region here, um, we give to the Maryland Food Bank. And the Maryland Food Bank works with their local community pantries and partners to make sure that those donations trickle down and are used in the communities where, where we're making those donations. Um, the program started in 2008. We've raised um, just around $3.8 million to fight hunger. Um, so really great numbers. We're really proud of our program. Um, and you know, we thank our customers for being a part of it as well. And Jamie, you've been with the company for a while now. How does it make you feel just to be a part of a company that actually uh, puts their food where their mouth is as well as their efforts and just making sure that um, their priorities are in check? Yeah, absolutely. So as a food retailer, you know, the best thing we could do is give back to the communities where we serve. And one of the best things we could give is food. So I feel like, you know, we do a great job with that, um, you know, in with our customers Absolutely. and, you know, we can't do it without them. So it's, it's a great program all around. And you make it so easy for the customers to do a good deed just as they're going about their everyday lives, just to be able to round up or get that bag for $8 is really, really impactful. Jamie Hanoski, thank you so much for being with us. We really appreciate it. And we'll be right back with more Midday Maryland right after this. Stay tuned. <laughs> 